said what I felt to the colonel more often. Well, I loved him. He was lucky. <laughs> that I agree with. So, my cranky young woman, sun's up. I'm going to bathe. Do me a favor and look for my white gloves. strong husband walk all over me for decades. But now, now I'm available for public events and book signings and White House appearances. Have you met my granddaughter, Nadia? <coughs> She's going to make a great name for herself one day. Of course, she is terribly grateful to me for giving her the rights to the untold story of my little baby. Women all over America will thank her for bringing to life what is truly my most heroic struggle. And then, people all over the world will bid for the rights to the sequel. Nadia, her own story. Nadia, I have some hard things to say. If you need to keep me overnight. I know you don't want to hear this. Privacy is important to my family. I know the medication makes it hard for you to focus. Cost is no concern. You have to listen. I can't! I can't hear you! I won't! Get out of my head! I didn't mean you to tell me it was too late. Like I didn't know. Like I didn't know. What are you doing here? I... The album, when I say you could touch it. It was under the gloves. Oh. Well, what's in it? It's private. What a surprise. Well, there's some part of me wants you to see it quite badly. That sounds ominous. Go ahead. Look. Okay. Oh my goodness. What do you know? Some of the clippings still look like new. Now, I've been open that since the 30s, you know. You must have. Nearly every story published about the kidnapping. Every, not nearly. Why the blank pages? On the 72nd day, they found his body. It was bad enough to read such fanciful stories about the kidnapping, but impossible to read such grisly accounts of his death. So I closed the book, and that was that. But you keep it near you. I would, too. You must see now why I never discuss it. It's not a free part of the legend. I'm family. The legend wore off ages ago. I've been waiting to see a little of the real you. So this hardly qualifies. What? I keep the album near me because it's such a lovely ride. It's two months of time when he almost lived for me. Time when all the world imagined him alive and I could allow myself to get caught up in it. There were stories that suggested that he was on a boat in a row house. Breathing and crying, and I want him. How could you not imagine them? Dream of them even now. I don't dream of Hans. I would. I dream about Please killing don't. him myself. Anyone that can throw away a little Stop. life so it's far too easy. You must have wanted to shout for joy when they hung him. Please what goes around comes around, as they always say. Each swing of his no. body. Each swing a blow for your baby, Nadia. Each Please. choking breath your ransom. You want to finish the scrapbook? Get a picture of Hans' body in there. He didn't do it. I don't understand. We know he didn't do it. And even then, I can still see Hans climbing through that window. Here's a photograph. Like a memory. Oh, Graham. Don't you know what today is? Six years from his last night. Sixty years. In seventy-two days. In seventy-two days. Baby? No! Colonel! Colonel! Please! We already played this joke. It's not a joke. Bring me my baby. Something awful is happening. Bring me my baby! He's gone. Baby that very night? Yes. Tell 
baby's gone. <laughs> I know. We won't have any more. I'm sorry. This was a girl. <laughs> Is there someone I can call to you? No. No. I had no idea you should have called your mother. Why? Do you know? Mother always says she never loved me because she never learned how. I waited weeks before I could tell her about the miscarriage. And even then, she wouldn't talk about it. Said she lived her whole life in the shadow of one lost baby, and she couldn't face another. Said I must be brave, learn to deal with it. Like you, Knoxville. Tell me you called me. I came carrying my loss in secret because that's what we do in this family. I'm so sorry for you. How could I know? You never wondered why I came here so suddenly? You really thought it was just to keep you company. You think surprising things for love is that? And don't you see how sweet that was? How romantic. You want me to be inspired by flowers. Nobody brought me flowers. I want someone to talk to. Someone like me. That's not the same thing at all. Close enough. Hardly. You got to be easy. How much you spend that? The new ladder. I moved into the baby's window this morning. I was supposed to speak at the dinner this evening, so I knew you weren't expecting me to be on time. I got home a little early and parked down by the road so you wouldn't hear me, and then crept across the lawn and up the ladder to the baby's room. This is a punchline. My baby needs to sleep. It was asleep when I came in. I just meant to carry it down the ladder and out to the car. I was going to drive up and honk the horn like I always do, and when you met me at the door, I put the baby in my arms. I held it close. I did, darling. I did. I held it so close. But I caught my sleeve on the window, and that jerked my hands. Oh, no. And I tried to 